Brand new cyborg and hacker monsters just came out. I was looking at the base speed to see if there's anything ridiculous. All the base speeds are somewhat in the middle, kind of normal. The uh, cyborg, uh, sorry, the hackers have 100 base speed on everything. The light one has a 33% speed lead, but most people are never going to get this, so most people will not be able to enjoy. The light one looks pretty ridiculous, though, especially this. Uh, this mixed with the speed lead. I'm jealous. I'm jealous. And then we have the cyborgs, which are, I believe it is 104. So 100, uh, 104 for the cyborgs, 100 for the hackers. Nothing really, nothing crazy aside from that. And we have the speed, like whoever is the speed lead gets used regardless. That's how these situations always happen. Let's take a look briefly, briefly. I just want to see some of the skills. And then we, oh, we're here on the Europe server account. We're going to do some, that's kind of cool. Those, uh, those hackers kind of look like the... I like these animations. Oh, and then we have the passive. But those uh, those hackers kind of look like the vampire transmogs a little bit. Which, you know, when a game is out for 10 years and they're putting new monsters out. I wouldn't say all the time. Nowadays, they're putting new monsters out all the time. This is the AoE. Attacks all enemies decrease their attack power. Cool looking skills, though. I like that. I think they did a good job with these. And then the AOE defense break, yeah. I actually really like these animations. I don't know why I like these more than than I thought I would. It seems like my comment should be, oh, they look kind of similar to things we already have. But for whatever reason, I think this actually is cooler i think they, they some something about these they put more effort into i think it's just the movement of the movement of their bodies it just it, it feels a little bit more fluid than usual I, I i can't quite put my finger on on why but yeah it looks pretty cool and we at least get uh one free cyborg each so and I was taking a look at the rates for the, because I honestly I forgot what the, uh, what the banner increases. So the banner is between. Oh, that is very cool. <sighs> Damn, you come to us. Yeah, that looks really cool. Our team again doing a great job. Can't complain. But yeah, so the banner increases the, uh, the rates between five to seven percent, roughly. For new units. Just in general. I'm I'm sure it's the same as it always was, but And this only increases cooldowns on one, the primary target, so These are these are cool looking animations. I mean, they're often cool looking animations, but yeah, I think this is I think this is above average. I think these units are more I wanna say they're I, I am more excited about these than I am about the uh the Witcher units. But the Witcher units there was more units, so there was more opportunity to be disappointed, I suppose. There's a few Witcher units that are actually pretty good, though. Don't get me wrong. OP. The OP boy. The speed lead. The crazy skill, too. The new debuff. Oh, and then that's the, the passive. I mean, some of these passives, it's hard to know how good they... Did I mention we're going to do some summons? We're here on the uh, the Europe server account. We're going to do some summons. We have 101 10-year special scrolls, which was very fast to actually get these because I just logged in after work and, like, in 15 minutes, I'm like, oh, we have all of them. Oh, well, all of them from the one event. Uh, there's still more to collect after this. And then the more we summon, the more we get. So let's see. We got a blessing. Maybe we'll get something exciting. I'm at least hopeful that we might get a cyborg not really expecting a hacker though let's see we got a couple of shiny scrolls we've been saving s the rest of the scrolls uh for i don't know a couple of weeks because i i did expect something to come well i expected um the calm to us versions of the witcher units to come out now that's what I was really... Oh, very nice. <clears throat> no comment. <laughs> yeah, it was, 
<laughs> I'm like, what are you trying to show me? I know, I should, shouldn't say things like that. I shouldn't say things like that. <sighs> Canceled. Oh my god. Anyway, uh, so for those of you that uh, maybe have, like, I put two and two together. I'm sure a lot of you have already put two and two together. Com to us likes to do updates with new units before TOA resets. This way, if people want the new units, they have to spend instead of like, oh, I'm just going to wait for, you know, if they do it right after TOA resets, it's like the, everyone has scrolls because TOA just reset. Right. So they like to do it before TOA resets. That's kind of the... The sneaky thing, they're like, oh, well, I know, you know, T TOA didn't reset, I didn't get my free scrolls from that, so. So I don't have a stash, I'm gonna have to spend some money. <clears throat> right, we're not gonna comment on that again. <laughs> Moving on. But, I mean, we got we got a chance to get something. Not a great chance. We, I mean, we got, we got two cyborgs, right? What am I, am I gonna complain about that? I love to complain about everything. Uh, let's take a look at, no, that's not what I wanted to take a look at. Not this. I know what that is. Why is there no rate button? No, oh, here it is. I guess it... Oh, you can't see it anyway. <sighs> Tenure special scroll. Yeah. Well. <laughs> Maybe maybe we'll show it on the uh, on the other one, but yeah, there's there's a rate button here. It's popping up, but you can't you can't see it on the. Uh, what if I highlight? Nope, no no. Uh, ten year special scroll acquisition rate for default five star water fire wind zero point four five percent. Default five star light dark zero point zero five percent. Very very low, of course. Uh, default four star fire water wind six percent. Default four star light and dark two percent. So, one in every 50 should get an LD4. And we have 101. So, let's see. I and mean, we're not, we, we got to do the rest of the summons first, but yeah, let's uh, stick some of this stuff in storage. Let me keep, I want to keep these out. Because I'm working on, I'm always working on fusing stuff. Oh, wind cyborg. Okay, so we got we got a handful. So uh, we got three. It's not a handful. Three could be a handful. I don't know. Dokebi. What else? Dokebi. Thank you. I'll take any of the new uh, the new things for skill ups. Hmm. PK. Why well, we're getting decent lightning. Might be nice to get a couple. I'm, I'm hoping to get a couple LD4s from those 10 year scrolls. I don't, the, the odds of getting a five star, an LD5 is still very low, but very, very low. But I think a one or two LD4s is, could happen. Cause 2%. from these okay water desert warrior now I feel extra guilty for not taking the fire you see I I took the Wusa and then I'm like he's because Wusa is great he's he's very useful but then I'm like we have Beta, we have Chloe then I'm like guilting myself into like why didn't I pick the fire desert warrior I should have picked that okay another water one I suppose that's what we're gonna build it. Well, the wind one's gonna be meta for uh, for siege anyway, because of speed lead. So, or rather, gonna be used in one way or another. Because anything with a speed lead gets used. I shouldn't. No, I shouldn't say anything with a speed lead gets used. But like Beretta's got a speed lead. I don't really see anyone using Beretta. Like, hold on, guys. Got to do some competitive siege with Beretta. And now that I say that, someone's gonna be, someone in the comments is gonna be like, uh, this YouTuber actually does competitive. He does Beretta and he does, uh, I don't know what else would, I, well, I suppose you could run a Beretta team, a Beretta dot team, Beretta, Dark, Robo, and something else, and like maybe a Soth, 
So could be that could be a thing. We got a couple of LDs too. Do we need anything from here? No. I don't know what I'm even looking for from those anymore. Uh, we'll just put those in there. It's fine. Not the end of the world. I'm too lazy. Too lazy. Mystical scroll. Special bonus event. Oh, we should have done that afterwards. Yeah, kind of not a, not a great return on those. Oh, yeah. Cool. I'm not going to just keep doing those over and over and over again, but... Oh, blessing. Hopefully we'll pop it. Either way, we get another uh, another cyborg. Do we have Megans to jiggle? I don't think we have Megans to jiggle. We don't really need to jiggle Megans anyway, do we? We'll jiggle some... Why not jiggle something? We got five scrolls. We're not going to get anything for five scrolls. Oh, hold on, guys. We're going to get something crazy from five scrolls. Okay. Light poison master. I'll take it. Better than nothing. See, I can be positive sometimes. Once in a blue moon. <laughs> Okay, another uh, water cyborg. They really want to give us these water cyborgs. No complaints, they're new units. Legendary all attribute. Yeah, we could have done this later though. Okay, fusion. She's a useful unit, don't get me wrong. I'm going to use her as fusion because I'm sure we already have her. Okay, lightning. Well, we did get something. And something is better than nothing. I feel I feel guilty if I feed this for a blessing now. Wait, don't we have I think we might have multiple phoenixes on here. Possibly or maybe I f Yeah, we don't even use the second one. All right, I'm feeding third per the third perna for a blessing. There's, there's no point in having so many of those. I know we have other, other things to, uh, we could feed for blessings too, but yeah. Let's see. Well, we got LD, uh, LD3. LD4 here, Light Succubus. At least we have more access. Wow, more, uh, more LD3s. It's weird to see that. It's weird to do a 10. Whoa! I don't know why I'm so excited. It's not like he's a crazy meta unit. I'm just very excited. I've never summoned this before. Yeah, sure. I'll be excited about that. Why not? Brand new LD4. I'll take it. Wow. Okay. So we have three L. Did I read the rates wrong? I knew we were going to pop some, uh, some LD3s, but... I'm surprised to see that many LD4s already, because it's only a 2% chance. So it's one in every 50. Oh, maybe we've already summoned. Um, we did a few 10 pulls. Which one is this? Light Gladiatrix. That is new. Wow. So this is where you get LD4s. Got it. I'm taking notes. Wow. We got quite a lot of LDs here. I think this is good. I think Kato should keep doing this. Because the LD5 rates here are still very, very low. But at least, you know, at least it gives people more access to LDs. Like, I'm, I'm pretty hyped about the Dark Joker, if you couldn't already tell. So, yeah. And it's not, it's not like it made the account crazy. Why not? Just a fun, uh, fun new LD4 to try out. I have never summoned that in 
10 years. And why, why do I have to think? It's a 10-year anniversary. Right. You've been doing this for 10 years. I've never summoned it in how long? 10 years. Right. Never summoned that in 10 years on any... I don't believe on any account. Even like the... Even like the throwaway accounts. Like the, the ones that we played for a couple weeks and then... Uh, like beginner to grind uh, number 12 and number 17 and number whatever. Because we keep doing... We would keep doing early game playthroughs over and over and over again, but... Yeah, so we are out of those. We get a Witcher Scroll, and then we have whatever else from the... Because we got a couple more from the event. There's a fire. Yeah, they still look the same. Hey, Dark Joker, I'll take it. And we got a Perna that we fed for a blessing it's just recycled recycled perna oh we have another cyborg to get kung fu girl those 10 year scrolls are kind of fun to see the the LDs pop out oh look out lightning what do we get Okay. Can we get what we're missing? Fire? Can we get a fire one? Nope, we get another water one. Yeah, I've seen I've seen it. I know I, I know. Thank you. Thank you. Jeez, I'm going to hell. Alright. So not bad. We should probably build the rest of the stuff that we keep summoning on this account. Oh yeah, we got this one too. Like Gladiatrix. Four LD4s. That's ridiculous. I'm going to just build this right now. No, I'll awaken it for a thumbnail. I mean, I, I suppose I could just awaken it now for a thumbnail. That's fine. Whatever. I like to take the thumbnails from these. He's got good attack power, though. Good, good base attack. But... Yeah. Anyway, I suppose that's going to be a spotlight at some point in the next couple weeks. Why not? I don't think we have a bomb team on this account, so we're going to have to build that. But not a, not a problem. Anyway, that's it for this one. Uh, hope you guys get some awesome summons on your own accounts. Of course, hope you got the coveted LD5s. And <laughs> hope you got the new, uh, the new light hacker. So anyway, that's it for this one. See you as always in the next one.